Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video series, I will explain how to create a simple machine learning project without knowing much about machine learning. We will be doing that by using inbuilt Python libraries and functions. The title of the project is Twitter Sentiment Analysis Using Machine Learning. It will basically predict the sentiment of the tweets that we give as an input to the application. I have already created this project as a part of my engineering curriculum. So in this video series, I will be explaining the code and functioning of the application. If you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will be posting more such videos on code explanation and simple projects for learning. If you have any doubts, please mention it in the comment section. I will try to explain it in further videos. So do subscribe and support me. So basically, I have created a web application for which I have used a Python Flask for backend to run the application on localhost. Navebase is a probabilistic machine learning algorithm that is used for classification problems and I have used the same algorithm in this project as well. TweeP is actually a Python library that is used to access Twitter API. So by using this we will be able to fetch tweets from Twitter website. Next HTML and CSS uh, I have used that for designing the web page for front end. I will be using VS Code as my editor throughout the video series. You can choose any IDE of your choice. Also, we will be needing a Twitter developer account, which I will explain how to create in later videos. Before I begin, I just want to mention that the application cannot give 100% accurate predictions. This is just a simple application to try and understand the concepts of machine learning. We cannot expect our algorithm to work perfectly. A lot of research and tuning is required to attain that level of accuracy. By saying that, uh, let us move on to the next section. So, the application mainly performs two tasks. First one is phrase level sentiment analysis and the second one is sentence level sentiment analysis. In phrase level sentiment analysis, a phrase is given as an input to the application and it will fetch all the tweets containing that particular phrase in it. Then we will determine each of the tweets sentiment. In sentence level sentiment analysis, we will give a message or a sentence as an input to the application and determine whether the message is positive, negative or neutral in sentiment. Let us start by understanding how the application actually works. So I have created a simple flowchart to make you understand the concept. So Twitter has already provided us with an API or application program interface to fetch tweets from Twitter website. We will be using this Twitter API in our web application to fetch necessary tweets from the website. As you can see in the flow diagram, these are the fetch tweets. Once we retrieve the tweets from Twitter API, we will apply machine learning algorithm to those tweets. The machine learning model will predict the sentiment of each of the tweets, whether the tweet is positive, negative or neutral in sentiment. So this is the overview of how the application works. Now I'll give a short demo of the project. So this is what the application looks like. Basically, as I mentioned earlier, our application can perform two tasks. One is phrase level sentiment analysis and the other one is sentence level sentiment analysis. In phrase level sentiment analysis, we need to give any phrase as an input to the application. Basically, Twitter API will fetches all the tweets containing that particular phrase in it. 
and whatever the tweets the api has fetched for us we will do sentiment analysis on each of those tweets count is the number of tweets that we want api to fetch for us now let us take here trump as a example phrase to the application and i will give the count as 3 let us see what the application will predict for us yeah so this is the results page so the api has fetched us three different tweets and uh, these are the predicted outputs as you can see in each of those tweets we have trump phrase in it and corresponding to each of the tweet uh, we have also received its sentiment so this is the sentiment predicted by our application so this is how phrase level sentiment analysis works now let us move back to the home page now in sentence level sentiment analysis we need to give any statement sentence as an input to the application and it will predict its sentiment for example let me take a sentence as um my my experience here was awesome and when i click the credit button so our application has predicted the sentiment of the statement as positive now let me take one more example this is a bad investment now when i predict for this our application is giving the predicted sentiment as negative now one last example let me take the statement as i am going for a walk today yes our application has predicted the sentiment of the statement as neutral so this is the overall working of the project in the next video i will explain briefly about api function and also on how to create twitter developer account so thanks for watching please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel